of Tucson's most respected and well-known trauma surgeons is leaving. Dr. Peter Ree is known for his work on January 8th. Among others, he helped save former Congresswoman Gabrielle Gifford's life. He's moving to Atlanta's Grady Memorial Hospital as chief of acute surgery and director of their trauma center. Now on your sides, Keen Thomas has a one-on-one -on -one with Dr. Ree. Dr. Peter Ree is leaving the place he's called home for the past eight and a half years, the longest he's ever had one mailing address. I call this home and I always will. He became a household name after January 8th when he's credited with helping save Giffords. She was shot in the head and rushed to the hospital and that's when Dr. Ree got the call. I was actually going for a run. I heard my phone go off. I uh, saw it, talked to my guys here. And they said, you got to come in, and I got my car and got here in time. Ree says Giffords and others were lucky because by that time, he had helped build UAMC into a well-respected trauma center capable of handling a big crisis. She was fortunate. Uh, our survival rate from people shot in the brain when I first started went from 10% was up to 47%. Uh, when news of Dr. Ree's departure began coming out, he even got a message from an old friend, Mark Kelly, Gifford's husband. You know, he just said sorry for the, you know, loss, his loss and, uh, and my gain. So um, he was just very nice. From Tucson, Ree will move to Atlanta. You know, I feel like I've done everything I can here. Where he hopes to build the trauma center there, just like he did here in Tucson. It's easily the double the size of the trauma volume here right. in Tucson. And it's, uh, it's got two medical schools. It's going to be a very exciting time period for us. Keaton Thomas, KGON 9, on your side.